Miari gena usakasakabo, hola y buenos dia, hello and good day. It's Elba again, aka Phoenix Taino, playing some more wakfu. All right, so the goal for today is to level up, level up, level up, level up, level up. I want to get to level 30. That is the goal. That is what we're going to try to do. Um, I'm probably only going to play for like an hour, because I do have somewhere to be in the next hour and a half, but then I'll be back. Oh, yes, I just remembered that before I went to bed last night, I was like stuck, which can happen in the game. Like sometimes it glitches, so I'm thinking that may have been what happened last night, and I just, I was tired anyway, so I was like, this is creator telling me to go to bed. <laughs> this is, I took it as a sign. Um, and now, oh, well, apparently that means that I have to start from the very beginning of this temple. And that's okay. I'm not mad at it. Uh, temples are subject to a set of very specific rules. There is an item with unique powers hidden somewhere. Golden chests can only be opened once. The large chest... Okay, it's fine. We didn't need to read the whole thing anyway. <laughs> oh, wow. Not the fucking character laughing again. That was some interesting timing. Sorry, I had to go close my bedroom door. My husband is doing homeschool with the child, so... Hmm. I think, if I recall correctly, these characters don't do very much damage to me anyway, but I would much rather... Oh wow, that's interesting. Just have him do that then. wondering now like what would a person who doesn't have like a, a character who's um like melee dominant I guess would be the best way to put it like what would they do if they can't really move closer to these characters I, I want I want to say I want to believe anyway that every character has um at least one long range attack, you know what I mean? But I don't know for sure. I don't know for sure. I really hope I don't have to go that way. Because that's when I got stuck last time. And there's like these things that look like it's some kind of teleportation. And I, it, it had me fucked up last night. It did. I don't know if it was part of the game and I'm just... There have been so many instances in this game where I'm cl it's clearly user error. <laughs> um, I'm the problem. It's me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's me. <laughs> but um, it might have been a glitch, too. Because I know it's happened while I was playing with Nietzsche, and she would go to, like, uh, for example, when we were co oping last night, she wanted to get on the ship, and it wouldn't let her click. It wouldn't show anything. And she was like, what gives, man? We figured it out eventually, but at the time, it was rather annoying. Quiet, little. The only thing I don't like about this attack seems like even hits targets that I don't want to hit. Oh, right on time. What does this target mean? Okay, the bear is 
is the enemy the focus is on. Okay. And they're not really neat to anything in particular, so should I do some kind of move? Is he within range? Oh. Yeah, we're gonna... I should poison you. Because... Dude man over there is about... is about done. Yeah. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna do that. Oh, I don't need to summon a block. I just need everyone to attack him. Because... This guy can move one. Hey, wait. No, we'll hit this. Those two are gonna attack him anyway. See? Ta da! Alright, see, that door opens, indicating that that is exactly where I'm supposed to go. This door is not open. Maybe it's a trap. Maybe I'm not supposed to go that way. You know what I mean? Okay. Go through. See? It was it did not let me do that yesterday. But maybe it's because I went to an area I wasn't supposed to go to until later? I don't know. I don't freaking know. Um, these guys are pretty weak. I don't, I think, I think I'm good right now. Because sometimes where you start on the board, 100% matters, you know? Um, but in this instance, because, because Nietzsche has kind of been carrying me through this game, I don't think it's a concern. It's so much of a concern. I'm gonna hit. Oh, they didn't do anything. Are they like immune to water? Not really. Well, that's upsetting. Let me get over here. We're gonna we're gonna let him block. Turn around. Turn around, girl. Thank you. And you. I want you here. I want you here. And I want everyone to attack the guy in the middle first. Because the other two probably have to do more moving around to get to me anyway. This one only takes two hits to be KO. So we're okay with with it being the way it is. Water didn't really do much, at least the attack that I did. We can. And I still have one more move. I mean, let's get close, but we'll let me give him some more energy. Health. I shouldn't need it, but you know what? I learned my lesson in other games that it is a good idea to just prepare for the worst, hope for the best, you know what I'm saying? So. And what I also like about having so many dolls, when you're playing with other people, it can get annoying. Um, Cause I noticed like with Nietzsche, my dolls would sometimes get right in her line of sight. So she couldn't, she was limited to what attack she could use. 
but um, at least when I'm trying to play by myself, it benefits me to have all these dolls on the board because then it requires for my enemies to kind of, um, to work harder, you know, to work harder. Ooh, I hadn't used this hammer yet. Yeah, leave me alone. Look at that. Just healing. We are a community. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why he died. He's, was he the one I poisoned? Doesn't matter. Oh, snap. A big chest. That's the key I needed. So I was probably supposed to go this way first. And then I can explore the rest of this area. Ta-da! Now I can go through this obviously locked door. Because I have the key! I'm assuming as soon as I step here. No, no automatic attack. Locked cage. Oh no, who's in the locked cage? What are pests like you doing here? Excuse the fuck out of me. I doubt you've come to swell my ranks. Sure didn't. Leave no survivors! Whatever. All right, let's go. What is he looking like? He's looking like an asshole. Is what he's looking like. That is not at all what I meant to do. to be on the big guy. Plus everybody else. Yeah, everybody else only has so many moves in there to be able to close ranks. And that's why I gave you a little bit of protection. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that more than once. That was pretty cool. Heal damage. Oh, I can't hit multiple. Yes, I can. Oh, that's right. The water doesn't do anything. I forgot. Damn it. Okay, it's fine. Uh, status is if the dolls want to see you die. What? Oh no, that's the status because of not me, him. Okay. I was about to say, like, wait a second, they're my dolls though. How they gonna turn on me like that? Was it a spell? Mind control? What is happening? Bro, you are not going to last very long. And you're still within range, it looks like. Yep. You're done. And we knocked out a couple of them at the same time. Don't 
do the water thing. Don't do the water thing. Don't do the water thing. That's not gonna hit. Well, this water thing didn't work. It doesn't mean this one will. Yep. See? Look at that. I should move here. That way, they gotta look a little bit harder to get to me. This might be close. Unlock a new spell. Nice. Help! They want to sacrifice me to Ogrest. I'm assuming that's what it said. It kind of, if I make it out alive, I bet I won't even get any compensation. I hate that it doesn't like leave the text on the screen enough. Oh, but I leveled up. Saving the Astrob Knight, it seems that Shreddy has captured a mysterious Astruvian mercenary known as the Astrob Knight. We have to go and save him on the double before he becomes a lowly offering for the villains in Ogrest's cult. All right. Pappy Paul asks you to go back and talk to him once you're ready to go to Mount Zinnet. While he waits, he's ready to find out more about ways to get to the cursed island. Okay. In order to build your character and increase your strength, don't hesitate, for example... To complete the, si the sets of quests for the mercenaries and the guild of hunters in each of Astrub's three regions, the town, plains, and sewers, or visit dungeons in those same areas. Cool. What's that? Mercenary cave. A good mercenary must always protect his behind. Yeah. Unlike what this guy did. You, you there. Something that's not on the screen anymore. <laughs> I never should have trusted a green talking schnet. What is that supposed to mean? All right, so if I make it out of love, I bet I won't even get any compensation from Pappy Pal. Well, aren't you... Do I want to go this way? What does that take me to? back to Astro. So I still need to get his ass out of here. I'm assuming that okay. See, there was a chest over here, but I don't remember what it gave me. Okay, I'm going to pay attention. Okay, so I need to go here. Now, is this going to fuck me up? I already emptied this chest of its contents. That's what happened last time. And it was like I was, like I trapped myself. You're too far away to do that. See, makes you go here and you fall in the hole. Okay, that's exactly what happened last time. So I just got to wait for it to be closed before I walk over it. Then I can, it won't let me click here. Oh no, it's doing the same thing it did to me last time. Uh, I thought maybe, maybe. So this must be some kind of trap. Now I know. I thought maybe the key was in here. Lever. Too far away to do that. How am I too far away? I'm literally right next to it. Oh, there's a lever over here. I did not notice yesterday. on this lever. What did that do? Uh, 
Oh, thank God. Okay. Too far away to do that. Now am I still too far away? Too far away to do that. Do I need to click that other lever? Oh! I'm still too far away. No, I'm not. Okay. I'm so confused. And now what happens? Just puts me on either side of the thing. That doesn't help. Did the door open? Let me. Hey, handsome. No, not yet. I still have. I still have. Oh, okay. Whew! I was about to be upset with myself for having gotten stuck in that same room. All right, so it's just a matter of pressing things in the right order, I guess. I don't know. Why won't it? Oh, that's right. There's this. Oh, this place that I needed to enter. No. Just takes me to that same place. And there wasn't anything in here that I recall. But let's just check what do you mean i'm too far away i was literally just in this room the other i don't understand well it says speak to pappy pal so maybe once i leave here i kind of feel bad because it kind of feels like i'm abandoning this night I guess I could always come back. Maybe worst comes to worst. Maybe it like automatically lets him leave. Interesting. Oh, okay. Let's see. You! It's you! You are the hero of the prophecy. There's no doubt about it. Ooh. Join me immediately on Mount Zenith. In half an hour. Defeat Ogrist. No, I'm trying to focus, love. I, Ulu, the messenger of the gods, will be keeping an eye on you. Okay. supposed to worry about the night. Maybe the game automatically releases him once I leave. Where am I in comparison to the rest of the world? I do not... Okay, I see where I'm at. And then this is where I need to go. Speak to Pappy Pal. So I just need to go south and then more west than anything? Oh, this is the mercy. Okay, I think I know what I'm at now. That is, yeah, the mercenary reserve. If he's here, and then I take a left over here, and then Happy Pals House should be up here. Yes, look at me. <laughs> You were able to defeat the members of Ogress cult in the sewer temple? Oh yes, they won't soon come back, wreaking havoc in Astrup. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, little one. I knew you could do it. 
You have the potential to become a great adventurer. Good thing you were able to you were there to heal the knight. He owes you. By the way, I met a certain Ulu or Uyu who told me I was the hero of the prophecy. <gasps> the hero of the prophecy. I also had that impression the first time we met. I wouldn't say you are the hero, but I'm sure you could become the hero. What did this Ulu tell you? He asked me to join him immediately on Mount Zinnit. <laughs> Mount Zinnit? It's a very dangerous place. In my opinion, the best way to get to the Cursed Island would be aboard the Hulkatz's The Black Purr. There. <laughs> Sorry, I just realized this is a play on words. The Black Pearl, Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah. Anyway, they're in Astra, near the port to the east. Go talk to them, but tell Master Boss Owl you're leaving beforehand. He'll have some precious advice to give you, because Mount Zinnit is nothing like the challenges you've faced so far. I'm going to find Master Boss Owl. Thanks, Pappy. Oh, I nearly forgot. Take this. You've earned it. It's not much, but you're family now. So, come back and visit whenever you want, and remember to say goodbye to Mammy. Apparently, she wanted to tell you something. Thanks, Pappy. Quickly. Now I need to go in the house to talk to Mammy. Speak to Granny Pal. All right, so Pappy Pal has advised you to go see Master Boss Owl before speaking to the Hulkats, singers who regularly take the world of Twelve's most courageous and temerarious adventures to Mount Zinnit. Increase your strength. Don't hesitate, for example, to complete the quest for mercenaries and the Guild of Hunters in each of Astrup's regions or to visit the dungeons in those same areas. Kind of feels like I should do that first. Mammy Pal has something to tell you before you leave. You should go say goodbye. Speak to Granny Pal. I would monitor it, but I am literally right here. And there's Mammy Pal. Oh, she's cute. Look at them big old glasses. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay. Oh, how beautiful youth is. I really envy you sometimes, but my old bones won't let me adventure anymore. I retired a long time ago. Did you want to see me? Mammy? What's going on? Where does the gamblin's name come from? When we got married, Pappy and I had to exchange a gift to symbolize our union, a dowry, if you will. This little gamblin is a proof of our love, more or less, but it's much too wild for someone my age. What a funny wedding present. Ooh, is that what you're going to give me? Do I get a little pet? That would be great. Did you want to see me? Oh yes, ever since he heard of your exploit, Dot's been betting to let him go with you. Ever since he met you, all he talks about is adventure, and I'm getting too old to take care of it. Would you take him with you? Of course, I'll take good care of it. Wait, before you go, I need to explain a few things about gamblins. They are creatures that can evolve if they eat very special stones. They say that fragments can be found in very special chests in the various nations and in dungeons. There's a machine called the Gem... Gem Evolver in the basement of the Astra Inn. You should check it out so you know what you need. Gemlins aren't very powerful pets, but they're perfect when you're just starting out. Evolving one's Gemlin, that strikes me as a good start. Where is a basement Astra Inn? Oh, I remember that. Uh, you might also stumble across items that can change the appearance of Gemlins. We call those items Gemligerms. They have almost all disappeared, but you could still find a few. Here, I'll give you the only one I have. I like Dot the way he is, so I never used it. But he's your pet now. Take care of him, and good luck on your adventure. Thank you, Mammy. I get a pet. I get a pet. I get a pet. Hey, 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 hey. All right. So before... Oh, wait. I need to talk to Papa Pal again, it looks like. Hey, little one. What can all Pappy Pal do for you? The Mercenaries Guild has plenty of different missions. A helping hand is always welcome. Don't hesitate to take on some of the missions posted on the Mercenary Boards. I have some questions for you. What do you want to know? Actually, I don't have any questions right now. Okay. <laughs> so we're done. We're done. We did all the Pappy Pal things. And what did, what did she give you? What kind of gem? Capable of fortune. 
All right, I feel like now is a good time for me to go into my hated bag. And let's put some of this stuff up. This was where I was last time, right? My other characters, I genuinely do not remember. Oh yeah. I'm supposed to have, oh no, it wasn't until level 30 that I could do anything new. What's that? Drain. This did damage, but this didn't do nothing. This kind of like, let's try, let's try drink. Let's put that there instead. I don't like that bag, but it really helped me. But this heals, this heals, right? It's the only heal, because this says it heals enemies and allies. This one allowed me to heal myself too, didn't it? Yeah, this one was one that I could heal myself with. Can I heal myself with this one? That's why I kept it. But I have this little bramble that gives me more health, so I should be all right. I should be okay. Display abilities here. And we got healing, berserk, rear mastery. I feel like This one. What's the rear mastery? Increased damage when attacking your target from behind. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. Ooh, percent block. Each block point makes you 1% more likely to reduce damage you see by 20%. That only goes back one. This goes by one. I think I'm just gonna do that. Trust your intuition, Inbox. We're good. Now, what was I supposed to do? Tell Master Boss Owl you're leaving. Pray at the Almanax. Astra Din. Where is Astra Din? That is a good question. Court. Happy Pals House. Mercenary Training. Mercenary Reserve. Nations Board. The Blasphemer's Crypt. That's the Administrative District. Haven Worlds. Astra Port. The bank, the marketplace, Bruda's Inn. Is that the same as Astrop Inn or the Phoenix? Oh, I never did touch the Phoenix. I did not know this until Nietzsche told me, but each area has a Phoenix. And when you click on it, you give yourself to the Phoenix. Now, if I were to, you know what I mean, be knocked out, I will, I will manifest here, which I want that to be the case for now because all my other characters also manifest over here by this Drago Express thing, and most of my quests and stuff kind of require me to stay in this area for now. What I do want to do though is pray at the Almanac's altar because I'd be forgetting to do that every day. Um, so let me go to the zap. So I'm pretty sure. Well, I'm right here. Let's. Sakuzo has invited you to join the guild. Druida. Do you want to accept the invitation? I don't know you. Hmm? I don't talk to strangers. <laughs> My mommy taught me to not talk to strangers on the internet. Anyway, um, hoo hoo! What can the head archivist of the world of Hoot? 12 do for you i'd like to become neutral again can you help me i'm i'm leaving for mount zenith could you help me out with something i've been wondering about i want to take care of the ecosystem i thought you were someone else what is this mm -hmm. what do you want to know what's an archivist mm -hmm. an archivist is assembling all the knowledge the wisdom of the world all the knowledge and wisdom of the world in books ah i get it you're writers mm -hmm. Can you tell me more about Astra? Mm -hmm. Astra used to be the city of mercenaries led by Brutus, the guild master. There's a statue of him on the huge fountain in the middle of Astra. I think I must have seen him already. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alas, since Ogris Chaos, 
you've got more sticks and whoop, stones than actual houses. These whoop, days, Pappy Pat was in charge of the Guild of Mercenaries and takes an active role in the reconstruction work. Thanks for the info. Can you tell me about the nations? Yeah, that's more than what we'll stop some. You can find all the information relevant to the nations on the board next to me. Thanks. I'll give it a read. Okay, I already looked at that though. Uh, nothing right now. And, um, yeah, it was this that I was supposed to do. Woohoo! Young incarnate, you're rising to the top like an arrow. I can see that you've already completed some achievements in our fair city. But know who this. Your future adventures won't be this easy. I'm ready for adventure. We don't think you who are ready for this adventure. We suggest you who increase your level before scaling mountains in it. You who won't be able to go there before you've reached level 21 or higher, which I literally just did. There are many ways to gain experience. You who can work through the main quest, massacre monsters, or complete dungeons. However, you should know that the mercenary post, the Guild of Hunters, the Automized Disciple, can also help you gain experience. All missions are good choices, so you who should check them out. Got it. I'm on it. All right. I mean, he was right there. So, now I gotta go to the Almanac's altar, then I'll come back. Where was it? Temples of Scripture. Then I'll come back um, and do my stuff in the bag, in the Haven bag. All the switching to the chest and stuff like that. Because I've got maybe 20-ish minutes to uh, the play before I should start heading out to do my adult responsibilities for the day or fulfill my adult responsibilities for the day. Done. There were two days that I forgot to, <laughs> to pray at this statue, so it should be at five, but it's only at three because I forgot. I forgot. All right, now I can go here. Let's go back to Astra Center. Speak to a member of the Astra Mercenary Post. Speak to a member of the Astra of Sewers Mercenary Post. Speak to a member of the Astra of Sewers Guild of Hunters. Oh, okay, I remember these guys. I remember these guys. I remember at least one for a fact that was in the sewers. Pretty close to the Zap, too, so. That's nice. Speak to a member of the Hunters, Automized Disciples. Okay, so all the people that Mr. Boss Owl guy mentioned. Right, let's do the hate and bad stuff first. Into the bag we go. Let's open the chest. Right, so we want Astro Miniature. I don't know what that's for. Astro Knight. Conditions for use does not have the Astro Knight sidekick. Huh? What is that? Mercenary Cape level 12. The cape I have on now is a level 9, so let's take the mercenary cape and put that on. Oh, I can't. Okay, you're a level 21, so I want you 22, 23. You are 11, so I can put you to the trade. What else do I have here? Looks like everything else I want to keep. Right? Maybe? Okay. Let's see. 
let's equip this and this because that's better than what I was currently wearing. And then it does not have the astro. Now, if I activate it, what what happens? Like, does he? I know I can put him back and forth. I don't know if I can disactivate that guy with what, so. Okay. Can I move stuff around? Move. Okay, so I feel like you should be over here. I can't put it there anyway. Should I move the crate over here? Maybe? You know what? Fuck it. Just leave it where it's at. Just leave it where it's at. It's fine. Um, We'll redecorate some other time. All right, we're in our haven bag. Let's go ahead and switch. Change character. Put the game inside another character. Yes. We're going to go to Ebunaru. And she should be here. Exactly. Let's go in the haven bag. Open the chest. now I have a cocoon and that eight eight okay so I'm just I don't think the other character has a ring the other character doesn't have a ring they only have an amulet I'm pretty sure so I'm going to leave that in there what I will look like. Why won't it let me? Oh, I'm not level 15 yet. That's why. I was about to say, what is going on? 14. You know what? Let me go ahead and fight real quick. Get to level 15. Wait. Wait. Oh yeah, I could probably go ahead and fight something real quick. Get level 15. And where do I want to go though? They'll probably fight a gobble for now. That would be just need to find a lone one. Because I probably can't take on more than one by myself at this level anyway. Four and six. I can handle that, I think. I mean, your little babies. Go ahead and face you because you're right on top of me already. And the white one's the one that's going to move first. So we're fine. What's your weakness again? I don't remember. Looks like. I think it's the earth, really. Shall set you a maze. Then. 
Might as well hit the bear spawn. Ta da! And then I can run away. Make you work harder to get to me. No. didn't really make a difference. <sighs> this rain. So maybe I should pick a fight with something a little bit tougher. Hey, you're by yourself. Come back here. And you're not one of the healing, one of the healing sheep. Let me do this. I'm gonna harvest the seed first. Come back. I want to fight you. There we go. I'm gonna say, don't run away again. All right, that's as good as we get. Actually, let's start here, because then he'll get closer to me anyway. He'll be in my range. See? See that there? Okay. I'm trying to remember what each of these moves even does. Okay, so I would need to move over one first. Do this. Slice. Wait, no. There we go. Go invisible and then move two squares over. So he's going to attack me where I was, not where I am. to move three spaces back. This is going to come closer to me anyway. Owie! But it's fine. Want to know why? You're done. Okay, yeah. So I just do one more battle with the higher level critter. We just find another solo battle like that one. Not you. Let's do that. We're gonna milk you, grab a seed, and then we'll attack. I need to be within three spaces of you. Let's do... Yeah. That should be good enough, right? Because they're going to get closer to me anyway. As long as I still have one movement point, it doesn't matter. I just need to be... Not in the square... Oh, that's right. I forgot. You give me more moves whenever I, uh... It's so funny, honey. <laughs> Boom. Level 15. Get my gobble egg. Okay. 
characteristics, or are we going to do the characteristic of what you got? Might as well do distance. We want to be a well-rounded player, as well-rounded as can be. And we got a new spell. What is this? Teleports to behind the target. One use per target. Mm. Ooh, what's this? Blood drop. Three uses per target. How close or far away from me do they need to be? I don't know. We'll, we'll play with that later. I need to go back to where my haven bag was. Dead? Oh yeah, there, there. The bow meow is done. That is a lot of KO'd bow meows. Came <laughs> back. And I just pick the same spot because then I'm less likely to forget. Where I put the shit. Put that up, put that up, put that up. And that as well. I can wear you now. Oh, oops. I gotta do my these. already have this item. I know I already have this item. Why won't it let me wear it? Is it worn whenever I leave the haven bag? No. Lies you tell! Your first outfit is getting card at reach level 15 to be able to equip it. But that's you know what? Maybe maybe I just need to, you know, I did I did what needed done. Okay. I don't know why this is blinking. Did I ever figure out why it was blinking for my other character before? I don't think I did. If I just click through everything and eventually it stopped. I don't know. Alright, find the trail of Ogress Cult. Is that the only thing I have on this quest book right now? Reach level 30. You don't know how to get a change of class. So that's getting this character to do what I just finished doing with my Sedita character. So I think I think I'm good. I'm go in my Haven bag, switch to my other character, do the same thing, and then take my happy ass on to run the errand that I need to run. Yep, that's gonna be the goal. Change character, yes. Go! Okay. Because you have some things that can be equipped. Or should be able to be equipped anyway. I, mean, I can't use that, but I can use this. That's it. Yay! And you are what, level 10? What 
don't have anything that I need to level you up for at the moment. So yeah, that's it. Wait, no, go back in your haven bag. Oh, it's your kitty. Let's switch back. I'm going to switch back to Ebunaru just to see if maybe like the game is being glitchy and weird and that's why I won't let me use change my outfit because I want to change the outfit. Already burned. How? I, I could not possibly have learned it until just now. So how do I change the clothes? Do I maybe... If I do this... No, it says already learned. So if one of my characters has the outfit, the others can't? Is that... Is that what it's... it's that's what it seems like. It's trying to that the game is suggesting. So then why give each character an Incarnum costume if you can't see? I don't know. We're gonna do one more thing. I'm going to close the app and then open it back up and see if maybe, if maybe that's the We'll see, we'll see. All right, just bear with me and the blank ass screen. Now that I think about it, I should add a different background. Something a little bit more eye-catching? I don't know. All right. Let's do maybe. If maybe. Oh, there's my alarm. Should let me use it, but it's not. No me gusta. So what I'm supposed to do? Sell this? Like it? All right. Well, that's that. I think I'm gonna go ahead and yeah, I'm definitely gonna go ahead and quit. I'll be back later.